What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for watching and subscribing. We've got a great video for you guys today. We're going to talk about why so many drivers are quitting Lyft right now in this current economy. Before we jump into this video, we wanted to give a quick shout out to today's sponsor, Play Octopus. Play Octopus is the best way to make additional income as a driver. They basically send you a tablet. This tablet will attach to the back of your headrest. They send you a mount for it and everything. And customers can play games on this tablet while you drive. This is an incredible feature because not only does Play Octopus pay you if they're playing the games, but on top of that, offering that extra entertainment for passengers is a great way to get higher ratings, make more tips, and just give a better overall experience. I've used a lot of apps, a lot of second, you know, third party platforms uh, to try and boost my income and just different things. Play Octopus is easily the best. I've personally made the most from using it as compared to other apps out there and different things we've even talked about on the channel over the years. At the end of the day, it's like, let's be honest, there's a lot of rides where you just feel a little, uh, dead in the brain like you can't really engage that well so even having this as a conversation starter is a very very valuable piece there's no cost to drivers to get started they're in pretty much every single major market so there's really no reason that all drivers aren't using this they have over 40,000 drivers using play octopus right now and if you're not one of those 40,000, you definitely should be we left a link in the description below so you guys can check that out I promise this is the one you definitely want to have. Alrighty. So as you guys know, Lyft driving has changed a lot. Um, I remember back when I started and they still offered the power drive bonus. I could make almost two grand a week for, you know, a 50 hour week. But even so, I was probably 22 or 23 at the time. It was just an amazing way to make money. I loved it. And as the years have gone on, uh, gone on they've pretty much gotten rid of every type of bonus. Uh, they've dropped our rates just year in and year out. It's gotten to a point where the platform itself, to me, almost isn't worth using. Also, it's kind of no secret that Lyft is a little bit less superior as far as overall money making compared to Uber. I know some of you are in that one weird market where Lyft just dominates for whatever reason. This doesn't apply to you. <laughs> but the main thing is, too, that you have to consider is as gas prices have changed, is this still worth it? And while gas has gone up, a lot of people will argue that, yeah, you know, maybe I'm paying a bit more for gas than I traditionally have, but I can still make some great side money. The main thing is full-time driving. So Lyft drivers that average 45 to 50 hours a week right now can make around 800 bucks a week on average. $800 a week for 45 to 50 hours is just not worth it. If you're a college student or something like that, maybe it is. But the reality is, any of us that are trying to support a family, pay you know a house down, or anything significant, this is going to really not even be close to it. Now you have to factor in, okay, so you're making $800 a week. How much am I paying in gas? Okay, well, now you might take that down to $700 or maybe six to $650. 6 to 650 for 45 to 50 hours a week is definitely not worth it. Now you factor in the wear and tear in your vehicle, the food you buy on the road, and everything else, and it starts getting to a pretty scary point where you realize you're really not making that much money at all. There was a recent study done with Uber where they showed that you're actually only making $6.20 an hour in a lot of markets. That is horrid, horrid, horrid money. I think the biggest thing that I take into equation with this is how there's so many more options to make money in today's economy that don't require you tearing into your vehicle. This is something we're going to actually cover on the channel here soon, is some ways you guys can make money doing different things, some things that I've done. Because the reality is, this rideshare industry has changed drastically. It is a shell of what it once used to be, and this is sad for so many of us. I personally can hardly rely on this. I go out and drive, you know, just from time to time, but I look at it as just side money, beer money, something like that, because I can't actually count on it to really pay any serious bills. So I think all in all, it's still decent to do part-time, just on the side from time to time, 
But the reality is the reason why so many drivers are quitting is they're having the same realization that I had in the last couple of years that there is just no way you can honestly count on this platform to make you any money that's worthwhile. Maybe a little bit on the weekend, that's probably the only way I would do it myself. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like, share, comment, subscribe. Check out Play Octopus linked in the description below. Guys, this is a game changer, and if you're still putting in heavy hours, you need to have Play Octopus. It's only gonna make you more money, and all you have to do is apply for it online. That's it. Nothing else. No payments, nothing else. So check it out, guys. Stay safe out there more than anything, and stay tuned for more updates.